Hi everyone, I went on a nature walk today and I collected some pine cones. Pine cones are really important to the pine tree because they house the seeds of the pine tree inside of them. And so that's why they are pointy and sharp the way that they are to protect the seeds inside. But sometimes there is an animal, a squirrel, that is able to get at those seeds inside. And this is a pine cone which a squirrel has eaten and has gotten all the seeds out of the middle of the pine cone. This pine cone, squirrel has not eaten, and it's open and it's sharp to protect the seeds inside of it. Uh, the squirrel is able to eat it from the bottom up and get the seeds out of it. And right now, because that this pine cone is open and it's been on the ground for quite a while, it probably doesn't have any seeds in it. But this pine cone is closed. And I bet if we take a look in between the little sharp points, we might be able to find one of the seeds inside of it. And so we're gonna take a look and we're gonna see if we can find any of the seeds. It being closed like this means that the seeds are probably still inside and they've been protected from either a squirrel or that they weren't ready to be dispersed yet or even if it was wet outside. So the pine cone has a really cool adaptation that when it's wet, it closes up. And when it's dry, it opens. And it does that very specifically because the seeds are like helicopters. They're shaped like maple seeds that we know. And so that's the little seed of a pine cone right there. And it has wings like a maple seed does so that the air can catch it and it can blow it around and disperse it. But if it gets wet, then it just falls straight to the ground. And so that's why when it's raining or the humidity increases in the air and it's about to rain, the pine cone closes up to protect its seeds even more so that they have a chance of dispersing and planting more pine trees in other places. And so an experiment that you could try is going to find your own pine cones, ones that are closed to see if you can find the seeds inside and ones that are open. Now the experiment is to take an open pine cone, submerge it in water for 24 hours and see if it closes up because it wants to protect the seeds inside. I hope you have fun on your own nature walk and doing the experiment. We hope to see you again. Bye.